Hello, I want to talk to you today about preparing for the new year. We're the first, this is the first week in, this is 2019, believe it or not. And I want to share with you something I have been doing since 1998. This will be the 21st year that I have been doing this. Every year I ask God to give me a scripture for the coming year. And the interesting thing is every year I do this, sometimes I have it before the new year starts. Uh, sometimes I think the latest I've gotten it was one year. I did not know what that verse was until February. Um, how do I know what my verse is? It just keeps coming to me. It keeps witnessing to my spirit. It's something that just um, almost explodes in me. It's like, wow, there's something about that verse. And so I write down the reference. I have one Bible that I have written every uh, the reference to every verse in. So I just want to encourage you. I know some of you really struggle with reading your Bible. You really struggle with your relationship with God after the death of your child. And that's okay. Okay. But I really want to encourage you, if you don't feel like I'm just not interested in having a Bible verse this year to be something in my life right now, um, ask God for a word. I know there have been a few years along with the scripture, there has just been a word that just, it's like, this is what I need this year. This is what I, what I want this year or whatever. So I just want to explain it in a way where you can grab hold of it and and uh, let it help you this year so uh, look for that word pray for that word think about it find that scripture whatever it is and one of the amazing things to me is how I look back at the end of the year and I see how um, extremely appropriate that scripture was for my life in that year and I there's one scripture in particular I'm thinking of that when I knew it was my scripture for that year, I it was um, I thought it was the beginning of the verse that God was going to do something with. And by the end of the year, I realized it was the last half of that verse that God just really brought life to. Just look for that scripture. Ask God for that scripture. Find that word. Something that's going to be meaningful to you. Um, even if you don't understand, it makes no sense. I have no idea why that is the verse that keeps coming to me or going through my head or in songs everywhere I turn that verse is around me um, even if it doesn't make any sense um, write it down and begin to really pray into it and meditate on it and let the Holy Spirit work in your life I just I really believe that it's going to be a key for you in a new year so this is Laura Deal co-founder of GPS Hope Grieving Parents Sharing Hope and we are here to be um, hope and light and to help you find purpose again after the death of your child.